What is up fellow YouTubers, SubduedGecko30 here, and I am back playing Mass Effect 2, guys. So in the last episode, we managed to finally, like, complete Jack's loyalty mission. And we're gonna continue next with the next loyalty mission, but for now, right, Thane wanted to see, to talk with us, so I'm guessing we're gonna begin, like, he's gonna give us his loyalty mission next. Shepard, I mentioned when we met on Ilium that I was dying. It's called Kepril's Syndrome. It's not communicable, but I have less than a year to live. Are you feeling sick? I could get the doctor. No, no. Though I suppose that is a part of it. My mortality has me dwelling on things. I had a family once. I still have a son. His name is Kolyat. I haven't seen him for a very long time. How long has it been since you talked? Ten years. He showed me some of his schoolwork and asked if we could dance crazy. We did that when he was younger. What sort of dance is that? It's... I checked my extranet contacts. I expect an update on my next target. The console plays music. Oh, unfashionable. Kolyat jumps into the room. My father runs around in circles. I scoop him up, toss him into the air. He shrieks, laughs, spin me. The console beeps. I put him down. Click the message. Father, he pleads. Tucks my sleeve. I need to read this, I say. I don't look at him. Did something happen to them? I abandoned them. Oh, not all at once. Nothing dramatic. No sneaking out in the middle of the night. No final argument or slammed door. I just did my job. I hunted and killed across the galaxy. Away on business, my wife would tell people. I was always away on business. You never mentioned this before. Why now? When my wife departed from her body, I attended to that issue. I left Kolyat in the care of his aunts and uncles. I have not seen him or talked to him since. That's not the choice I expected. Why didn't you raise him yourself? My body is blessed with the skills to take life. The Hanar honed them in me. I have few others. I didn't want that life for Kolyat. I hoped he would find his own way. If he hated me, so be it. He would not have shared the path of sin. I used my contacts to trace Kolyat. He has become... disconnected. He does what his body wills. You'll have to explain that one to me. Disconnected. The body is not our true self. The soul is. Body and soul work as one in a whole person. When the soul is weakened by despair or fear, when the body is ill or injured, the individual is disconnected, no longer whole. What's wrong with him? Is he hurt? Something happened that should not have. He knows where I've been, what I've done. I don't know his reasons, but he has gone to the Citadel. He's taken a job as a hitman. I would like your help to stop him. He is... This is not a path he should walk. Thane, I don't have your contacts, and I don't have your tracking skills. Why do you need my help for this? I don't need your help. I want it. The last time I saw my son, they wrapped her body in sea lines. Weighted it with stones. He tries to pull from me. Calls for her. The hammer lift her off the platform. They sing like bells. The fire has gone to be killed with a new. He begs them not to take her away. They let her body slide into the water. He hits me. Don't let them. Stop them. Why weren't you? It rains. It always rains on Kaji. Warm water pours down his face. I didn't mean to make you relive that. Perfect memory. It is sometimes a burden. I'll get us to the Citadel as soon as possible. Thank you, Shepard. I'll be meditating until you need me. Alright, so now we got Thane's loyalty mission. But before we begin there, any other loyalty mission, we're gonna do Morden's loyalty mission. Do where is it? 
at here. Alright, so now it's time to begin Morden's loyalty mission. So it's gonna be Morden, so I take Morden and we will take We haven't used Samara, so we'll bring Samara with us. leader wants to speak with you. Talk to him soon, alien. If we decide you're not welcome, you'll know just before we kill you. Alright, so with Morden... Okay, we'll get off this one. And show those Torians who's boss. Heard not clan reports use weak encryption. I see references to a captured Solarian in the logs of the Chief Scout. Good. Talk to Scout then. Or Chief. Either one acceptable. Also, I have been unable to access local medical records. I suggest asking the local... Were you around with the female camps and the children over last week? Uh, I... No. You don't want anything I sell, human. Greetings, human. My name is Ratch. Have a look at what I've got. Everyone I talk to hates that aliens are an Erdnot, except you. I don't have the luxury of turning away paying customers. I do enough business off-world to know that you aliens have more credits than people here do. I should go. Suit yourself. Oof. Got a lot of stuff, though. interesting and that's the last of my credits <laughs> all right so let's go talk to the to the scout then are the children probably five years from the right To pit living beings against each other for entertainment. Unforgivable. 
If I survive your mission, I may return here and instruct the Krogan on compassion. I'll need many bullets. Oh boy. <laughs> Watch it, human. What do you want, human? Rex told me to be polite. He didn't say you were going to talk to me. Wait, Rex? Rex is here? I'll have to deal with that later. Uh... I'm looking for a Salarian. The Blood Pack captured him and he was last seen around here. I heard about that Salarian. Poor bastard. If it's Blood Pack, then Clan Warlock has him. Sent one of my scouts to check it out, but he never reported back. Guess they got him, too. Chief told me to give you one of the trucks. Just follow the highway to Warlock's base if you've got the quads to deal with him in the blood pack. What can you tell me about Clan Warlock's base? Last I heard, the clan was holed up in an old hospital. I haven't seen it, though. I've only seen Clan Warlock from a distance. If I'd gotten closer, I'd have taken a shot. You get inside, though, bring a big gun. Warlock's base is crawling with blood pack. That doesn't sound too defensible. Why'd they hole up there? Any hospital on Tachanka has to be built well enough to withstand a bunch of enraged Krogan. When an injury forces us to switch over to secondary organs, things get messy. Higher thought processes don't always transition properly. Blood rage, they call it. Alright, let's take the truck. So of course we'll take some Mara with us. Oh, 
salvage some stuff off of these trucks, though. Time to run a bypass. Repurposed Krogan Hospital. Sturdy, built to withstand punishment. Body, human. Need to take a look. Sores, tumors, ligatures showing restraint at wrists and ankles, track marks for repeated injection sites. Test subject, victim of experimentation. I don't suppose there's a way to tell who this poor bastard was. No tattoos or ID. Maybe slave or prisoner, maybe merc or pirate. Irrelevant now. Clearly part of Krogan tests to cure genophage. Humans useful as test subjects, genetically diverse. Enables exploration of treatment modalities. Wouldn't something native to Tachanka work better? Varen, maybe? Yes. Human experiments strictly high-level concept testing. Native Tachanka fauna likely used later in development stages. Wise to delay use of Varen until necessary. Powerful bite. What can you tell about their experiments from looking at the body? Position of tumors suggests deliberate mutation of adrenal pineal glands. Modifying hormone levels. Counterattack on glands hit by genophage. Clever. Do you think they're close to curing the genophage? Can't say. Need more data. Conceptually sound, though. Genophage alters hormone levels. Could repair damage with hormonal counterattack. How are humans more genetically diverse? More variable. Peaks and valleys. Mutations. Adaptations. Far beyond other life. Makes humans useful test subjects. Larger reactions to smaller stimuli. I know we can look much different from each other, but Asari have a wide range of skin tones. No, ignore superficial appearance, down to genetic code. Biotic abilities, intelligence levels. Can look at random Asari, Krogan, make reasonable guess. Humans, too variable to judge. Outliers in all species, of course. Geniuses, idiots. But human probability curve offers greater overall variety. Experimenting on humans? That kind of crap is what makes Cerberus start to seem like a good idea. Never used humans myself. Disgusting, unethical, sloppy, used by brute force researchers, not thinkers. No place in proper science. <sighs> Krogan use of humans, unsurprising. I imagine you had to do some live subject testing while developing the new genophage. No, unnecessary. Limited tests to simulations, corpses, clone tissue samples. High level tests on Varen. No tests on species with members capable of calculus. Simple rule, never broke it. Now we've got two reasons to shut this place down. Focus on Malin. Too late to help the dead. Let's keep moving then. I am the speaker for Clan Werelock, Offworlders. You have shed our blood. By rights, you should be dead already. But Werelock Gold, the Chief of Chiefs, has ordered that you be given leave to f
Krogan don't generally let people go. What does Clan Warlock have planned? If you walk away now, you can tell your children that you saw Clan Warlock before our blood pack conquered the stars. You think the Erd not impressive? They are pitiful! Warlock Gold will destroy them! The Salarian will cure the Genophage, and Clan Warlock will spread across the galaxy in a sea of blood! Appears they discovered Malin's work. Unfortunate. It doesn't have to happen like this. I can understand wanting to cure the Genophage. No, human, you understand nothing! You have not seen the piles of children that never lived. The Krogan were wrong. We will make it right, and then we will have our revenge! Half the galaxy sees the Krogan as victims. If you start a war, you'll lose their support. We have the Blood Pack, and we have the Salarian. When our clan numbers in the millions, we will not need support. When we cure the Genophage, Warlock Gold will rule all Krogan. The Krogan Rebellions will become the Krogan Empire. The surviving races will frighten their children with tales of what the Blood Pact did to the Turians. The Asari will scream as their citadel plunges into the sun. We will keep Salarians as slaves and eat their eggs as a delicacy. Okay. If you lack the wisdom to flee, <laughs> then you will be the first of billions to be crushed beneath our might. For Warlock Gold, attack! close one. They nearly oh. killed me. Good thing I had the barrier. likely through there. Can smell antiseptic, hint of dead flesh. I hope we have a chance to avenge this. It makes two of us. <laughs> Active console may contain useful data. One moment. Genetic sequences, hormone mutagens is still steady. Protein chains, live tissue, clone tissue, very thorough. Standard treatment factors, avoiding scorched earth immunosuppressants to alter hormone levels. Good. Hate to see that. Most people wouldn't be so casual about developing a sterility plague, Morton. Not developing, modifying, much more difficult, working within confines of existing genophage a hundred times the complexity. Errors unacceptable, could cause total sterility, malignant tumors, could even reduce effectiveness, worse than doing nothing. Had to keep Krogan population stable, one in 1,000. Perfect target, optimal growth. Like gardening. Pretty it up however you like. You're talking about murdering millions. No, murdered no one. Altered fertility, prevented fetal development of nervous system. Have killed many, Shepard. Many methods, gunfire, knives, drugs, tech attacks, once with farming equipment, but not with medicine. You're saying you were working just as hard to keep their population from falling? Yes, could have eradicated Krogan. Not difficult, increased mutation to degrade genetic structure further. Chose not to. Rachni extinction, tragic, didn't want to repeat. All life precious. Universe demands diversity. What was it like working on the genophage modification project? Best years of my life. Wake up with ideas, talk over breakfast, experiments all morning. Statistical analysis in afternoon, run new simulations during dinner, set data runs to cook overnight. Laughter, ego, argument, passion, galaxy's biggest problem, massive resources thrown at us, got anything we wanted. Do you keep in touch with your old team members? No, all changed with deployment. Made test drop on isolated Krogan clan, hit rest of Tuchanka when results were positive. End of project. Separate ways. Watching it end, watching birth rates drop. Personal. Private. Not appropriate for team. 
Sounds like you were pretty important. How'd you go from that to running a clinic on Omega? Wanted to heal people. Good use of last decade. Something easy. No ethical concerns. Understand rationale for modified genophage. Right choice, still. Hard to sleep some nights. How can you agree with using the genophage, Morden? Look at what happened to Tuchanka as a result. State of Tuchanka not due to genophage. Nuclear winter caused by Krogan before Salarians made first contact. Krogan choices. Refuse truce during Krogan rebellions. Expand after Rachni wars. Splinter after genophage. Genophage medical, not nuclear. No craters from virus. Damage caused by Krogan, not Salarians. Not me. The effects on Tachanka are still your responsibility. You upgraded the virus that kept them in barbarism. Krogan committed war crimes. Refused to negotiate. Turian defeat not complete. Krogan could have recovered. Attacked again. Conventional war too risky. Krogan forces too strong. Genophage was only option. Krogan forced Genophage. Us or them. No apologies for winning. Wouldn't have minded peaceful solution. So if the Krogan banded together and formed a united government, you'd welcome that? Yes. United Krogan saved galaxy. Destroyed Rachni. Genophage not punishment. Simply alters fertility to correct for removal from hostile environment. We're not gonna find Malin staring at consoles. Come on. Alright then, let's keep it moving. Gotta find Malin. Dead Krogan, female. Tumors indicate experimentation. No restraint marks. Volunteer. Sterile, Werelock female willing to risk procedures. Hoped for cure. Pointless. Pointless waste of life. I didn't expect you to be disturbed by the sight of a dead Krogan. What? Why? Because of genophage work? Irrelevant. No. Causative. Never experimented on live Krogan, never killed with medicine, her death not my work, only reaction to it. Goal was to stabilize population. Never wanted this. Can see it logically, but still unnecessary. Foolish, waste of life, hate to see it. I didn't think you'd had much direct contact with things like this. Did you come to Tachanka after dropping your plague? Yearly recon missions, water, tissue samples, ensure no mistakes. Superiors offered to carry it on. Refused. Need to see it in person. Need to look. Need to see. Accept it as necessary. See small picture. Remind myself why I run a clinic on Omega. Rest, young mother. Find your gods. Find someplace better. I didn't expect spirituality from you, Morden. Genophage modification project altered millions of lives, then saw results. Ego, humility, juxtaposition, frailty of life, size of universe. Explored religions after work completed. Different races, no answers. Many questions. Sounds like you were trying to deal with your guilty conscience. The doctor who killed millions. Modified Genophage project great in scope. Scientifically brilliant, but ethically difficult. Krogan reaction visceral, tragic, not guilty, but responsible. Trained as doctor, genophage affects fertility, doesn't kill, still cause this. Hard to see big picture behind pile of corpses. Can you really just rationalize it all the way? How do you justify it? Wheel of life, popular Salarian concept, similar to human Hinduism in focus on reincarnation, appealing to see life as endless. Fix mistakes in next life. Learn, adapt, improve. Refuse to believe life ends here. Too wasteful. Have more to offer. Mistakes to fix cannot end here. Could do so much more. If you need this much soul searching to get over it, maybe the genophage was wrong. Had to be done. Rachni wars, Krogan rebellions, all pointed to Krogan aggression. So many simulations. Effects of Krogan population increase, all pointed to war. Extinction. Genophage or genocide. Save Galaxy from Krogan. Save Krogan from Galaxy. He could have cured the genophage instead. Brought hope to the Krogan. They'd have rejoiced. Assumes human reaction. Krogan stimulus response different. Harsh environment. Take chance to fight. Flee. Would have caused chaos on Tuchanka. Victor would have war economy. Bloodthirsty army. 
Galactic expansion only logical outcome. More war. Genophage saved lives, war would have ended. So you're willing to sterilize a species based on the evidence of a few simulations? Yes, millions of data points, years of arguments, countless scenarios, all noted Krogan fragmentation as dangerous, no unified culture to support repopulation. Would have been war, Turians and humans destroying Krogan utterly. Genophage was better, saved lives. Look at the dead woman, Morden. It doesn't look like you saved her. No, it doesn't. Worked with available data. Only option. No other possible. Doesn't matter. All right, let's see what we can hack this. Told us to watch for you. We've taken out the guards. Get back to Erdnot. I can't. The Warlock did things to me. Drugs. Injections. Said I was sacrificing for the good of all Krogan. Experiments to cure the genophage. Everything's blurry. Hard to think. I'll have to stay. Morden, can you get him back on his feet? Stims, maybe? Something to bolster his immune system? Understand. I'm not too sick to leave. I have to stay. They're curing the genophage. They're gonna make it all better. They have to keep doing the tests. Caution, Shepard. Patient unstable, susceptible, brainwashed. Why do you want them to keep doing the tests? This is my fault. I got caught. Wasn't strong enough. Not good enough. This is the best I can do. This is all I can do. I'm not big enough to have a real shot with the females. I'll never have kids of my own. But if I help undo the genophage, then I mattered. Millions of children will be born. Warlock children. They're gonna destroy the other clans. But... No. No, they said I was helping Erdnot. If you want to help Bird, not you need to get back there. But it would take a real badass to make it back to camp while injured. I can do it. <laughs> you? I said a badass, not some scout whining like a quarian with a tummy ache. I can do it. I'm up, and I'm going to the female camp. Damn right you are. Get back there and show them what you're worth. Go, go. <laughs> <laughs> Nicely done. Fortunately, subject is unlikely to be contagious. But all right, guys. So we are just, are gonna stop it here for now. That will be all for this time. If y'all enjoyed this episode, please leave a like and comment, and please subscribe. And I hope to see you all in the next episode, guys. See y'all later. Bye bye, guys.